What do you want to see next? Is there a unicorn? Actually, there is. It's called Monoceros, and it resides in the Northern Hemisphere. Here, look where I'm pointing. I can't see it. It's too bright. What do you mean it's too... Blake, get off your phone. I don't want to be a jerk, but I really don't want to stargaze. It doesn't matter if you want to or not. Your phone light is blocking our view of the stars. At least I'm being considerate. <sighs> Dad! Daddy! I have an idea! Oh yeah? Is there a dragon? Dragon? Hmm. Let me see. Oh, there is actually. Here, follow my finger. Can you see those three stars right there? Those are from Ursa Major. Now follow them up and to the right a little bit. See those two other stars? Mm-hmm. Those are called Edamon and Rastaban, the two stars that make up the head of the dragon constellation Draco. Wow, a dragon head! Does it breathe fire? It can if you want it to. Other stars, I want to see the whole picture! <laughs> okay, okay. If you follow it down along this snake-like trail, you'll eventually find... Huh? The second brightest star. Blake, can you turn your phone off? I'm having trouble seeing something. Come on! I know you want to see a dragon or something, but I want to finish reading the story. Maybe take into consideration my wants too. Honey, Eliza, Blake! It's late enough, and we've got to leave tomorrow afternoon. It's time for bed. Right on time. Oh, but I didn't get to see the dragon. Don't worry, Eliza. You'll see the full thing someday. Blake, are you sleeping alone again? Well, good night. I don't want to be rude to them. They can just be a hassle sometimes. I can't sleep. <sighs> Maybe, yeah, I'll take a midnight walk. I mean, I'm 18. I doubt mom and dad will care if I do something by myself. This spring break has been kind of boring. I was hoping my family and I could do something fun for our last break together. Well, besides summer break, I guess. What about going to Central Park? I mentioned that to them. It would have been a lot better than just camping around. I mean, I've always wanted to do that. Well, maybe I could have been nicer to them. It was kind of rude for me to be on my phone the whole night. However, in my defense, the book was getting really good. I'm not going to have opportunities like this much longer, will I? Dad will be engaged in his astronomy stuff. Mom will be working on duty all summer. And soon enough, I'll be starting my internship with Dr. Travis at the courthouse. Leaving home. Well, we still have all summer, right? They won't mind if I finish a good book on my phone tomorrow. Hmm? What's that? A crater? I don't think I saw this when we hiked yesterday. What is that? A girl? Is this a dream? Who is that? Should I go help her or something? No, I'm dreaming. Definitely. It's not every day you find a girl laying in a crater, and I didn't even hear an impact. Yeah, this is definitely a dream. It, it feels real though. No, this must be one of those fever dreams or whatever they call it. I'll just go back to bed. That will cause me to wake up. Yeah, that, that sounds right. Uh, I'm sure this isn't real. In fact, I'll wake up in the morning and leave like normal. I'll graduate from school and start my internship. Life will be normal. Everything is normal. <laughs>